Day Y Weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, terrific weather out there on this Thursday afternoon. My goodness, nothing but sunshine. Had a couple of high clouds this morning. Aside from that, it's been wall-to-wall -wall sunshine, light winds, temperatures finally rebounding. Still a little bit below average, but a much nicer afternoon. We went up to 58 on this Thursday, a morning start of 31. You can see the averages right there. And by the way, we're going to be close to that number, if not a little bit better than that, by this time tomorrow. Finally, the warmth is moving back into the region. It's 56 as we speak. Humidity 22%, a south wind just over 10 miles per hour. Let's go around the viewing area. 50s everywhere. Great to see after the chilly weather we endured the past couple, three days, as we have plenty of low and middle 50s now showing up all across the region. And once the sun goes down next 20, 25 minutes, the temperatures will start to cool off at a pretty rapid clip. So something to keep in mind if you have outdoor plans on this Thursday evening. But the pattern remains extremely quiet. Wow, severe clear across our region anyway. High pressure here up and down the eastern seaboard is still dominating our weather, but we're on the back side, so we're picking up that southerly breeze. That's why temperatures moderated a little bit today. They will do so more so, that is, uh, as we move on into the next couple, three days. You can see off to the west of us, plenty of 60s, even close to 70 in a few spots right now, and that is the warmth that continues to expand and move in our direction. But again, this evening, it's going to be kind of chilly, so if you have the outdoor plans, grab the jackets. 54 at 7 will quickly go into the 40s by mid-even, even low 40s by late this evening. This is the city. Remember, the outlying regions typically cool a lot faster and will likely be in the 30s by 11 o'clock or midnight. All right, I think everybody will be in the 30s tomorrow morning. It's going to be another chilly start to the day, the November chill alive and well. Not quite as cold as what we had this morning or yesterday, though. We're expecting low and middle 30s, about 36 on your Friday morning here in the city. And here is the weather in motion. Lots of sunshine again. These are just some high clouds that will creep in late afternoon or early evening. And there are your high temperatures tomorrow. That's better. That's where it should be for the time of year. We're back in the low and middle 60s on your Friday, looking at 64 here in the metro and that bodes very well for those area high school football games tomorrow evening as it's playoff time kickoff temperatures around 7 7 30 58 will slip into the mid 50s by the time the games wrap up here's your weekend weather a mix of sun and clouds saturday 66 nice day how about sunday right now it looks gorgeous light wind tons of sunshine and temperatures a mix of middle and upper 60s to close out the weekend wow here's your forecast this evening clear cool 50s will kind of sink back into the 40s the next few hours i think we'll wake up chilly again tomorrow morning with low and middle 30s climb to 55 by midday late afternoon 64 will be your high as we look at the two-day forecast now uh, saturday's Weather looks terrific, 66, a mix of clouds and sunshine. Don't forget UofL is in action at LNN Stadium. Saturday afternoon, kickoff slated for 3.30. They're taking on Vatech. Weather looks great, 60s for the tailgaters and also the football game itself. Here's the remainder of your seven days, 67 Sunday afternoon. How about the 75? <laughs> wow. Oh, how about that, Jack? <laughs> yeah, and we're close to 70 on Election Day for Wednesday as well. So. Weather looks beautiful on Election Day.